Hello friends, the World Health Organization says infectious diseases such as malaria, tuberculosis and HIV have long been some of the world's biggest killers. And while malaria, tuberculosis and HIV are just three examples, we have more than a hundred infectious illnesses which affect man and mankind. Do you know how these infectious diseases impact the health of the Indian population? The World Health Organization opines that incidences of HIV, TB and malaria have globally decreased since 2000, yet they still pose a major threat. And it is not just three of them. There are numerous species of bacteria, viruses and parasites and other microbes that have the potential to infect humans. I am Dr. Sabah and I am here to talk about all these infectious diseases. We will discuss viral diseases, we will explore parasitic infestations, we will take up bacterial infection and here is something which I am sure is new to you. Do you know what are prions? How do prions infect man and cause myriad diseases? I will acquaint you with prion diseases and we will explore these diseases from medical point of view. According to the World Health Organization, from declining mortality rates to ending epidemics of infectious diseases, the world has made significant forward strides. But there is still a lot more to it. Apart from continuously improving on global health stats, nations are also resorting to spreading infectious illnesses to cause widespread harm to life and economy. This has led to the emergence of something far more dangerous than conventional warfare and this is called bioterrorism. We will delve deeper into the issue and explore the various aspects of bioterrorism and biological warfare in this course. So join me in my endeavor to acquaint you with the core concepts of all infectious diseases. Just log on to www.thehomeopathicacademy.com and enroll in the course of infectious diseases. Thank you and keep learning.